Roast. Roast. Howdy folks, it's old Magnus Booner, and the first thing that I need you to do is smack that subscribe button for me. You are not going to want to miss any of the epic content that I keep creating for you. Tonight we're out on the Skokomish River in uh, the Olympic National Forest, and I've got a lovely koozie from Bucota, Washington, a bar stool or church pew kind of town. Go to Bucota, go to Joe's Place Tavern, and drink some beer, you'll be glad you did. Tonight, we are making a backpacking burrito. It's made out of all freeze-dried ingredients. Mm. First thing I need is six ounces of water. So that's one, two, three, three of these little hash marks on my Nalgene bottle. That might have been just a little over, but hopefully it'll be fine. While that water's coming to a boil, we're gonna add one quarter teaspoon of fresh ground black pepper. This is my GSI Outdoors Pepper Mill. You can go ahead and order one of these from Amazon and I'll get a kickback if you click my link. You can find that link on my blog. No burrito is complete without cheese. And I've got two one ounce sticks of this Lucerne brand Pepper Jack. I got this at Safeway. All right, that water's up on a boil. This is minute rice, dried beef crumbles, and some dried refried beans, as well as a bunch of spices. And the recipe will be on my blog. We're gonna add this to the boiling water. You can also do this as a freezer bag meal and add the water to the bag. I like to do it this way for whatever reason. So we're gonna turn off that heat and we're gonna add our two ounces of cheese. There's one ounce. So now we'll just stir in that cheese. We'll cover that and it's gonna sit for 10 minutes. While that's steeping, we're gonna go ahead and get our tortilla ready. My backpack has this big flat pouch that's designed for stuffing a, a coat in or something of that nature. I was able to stuff this tortilla in there and it stayed nice and flat. Didn't get crumpled up or ruined. We've got our tortilla prepped and once our filling's ready, we'll just fill it right up. All right, so this thing has been steeping for 10 minutes. Oh, it's nice and thick. You can see that cheese is all nice and melty. Look at that, just look at it, it's beautiful. That's burrito filling if I've ever seen it, I'll tell you what. Nice and cheesy and beautiful. All right, now we're just gonna turn this out on this tortilla shell. You're gonna think you're at a taco truck when you're eating this. And now we gotta roll this up and make a burrito out of it. So, you know, sides in. Now that is one beautiful little burrito. Let's eat it and see what it tastes like. All right, now I've got this beautiful backpacking burrito. Got a lovely Pilsner beer. Let's have a taste of it, shall we? It's getting dark out on me. Oh. Mm. Mm-hmm. That's tasty. It's nice and spicy. You get a real richness from that cheese. Black pepper's nice. Mmm. This is a darn tasty burrito, and it's great after the long hike I had getting in here. Go ahead and share this video with your friends. Find me on Facebook. I'm Magnus Booner. I'm also on Instagram as Magnus Booner. Find my blog at www.magnusbooner.com and we'll be bringing you another video real soon.